dear viewers from today onwards we will be starting a new segment of our youtube channel titled ask dr parish doshi here we will be answering one of the most frequently asked questions to me let us start today with understanding what is an alternative diagnosis of parkinson's disease or what is progressive supranuclear palsy a name which brings a lot of fear and apprehension in the minds of people and many times this psp or progressive supranuclear palsy looks similar to parkinson's disease however it is very important for us to diagnose this let me address and explain to you what is this progressive supranuclear palsy involves much wider degeneration in the brain and hence there are multiple more symptoms that the patient faces the treatment for psp or progressive supranuclear palsy is totally different from parkinson's disease in terms of long term management and outcome Symptomatic treatment still remains the same in form of levodopa. In patients of progressive supranuclear palsy, they complain of frequent falls. They try to slump back when they fall or sit in the chair. They have fixed staring look. Their eye movements or the eyeball movements are very restricted. They have sometimes swallowing difficulties. But the most classical feature of PSP diagnosis is backward falls patients while walking freeze and fall backwards and over a period of time they progress much rapi rapidly than patients of parkinson's disease and hence the treatment remains ineffective after several years why is the diagnosis of psp very important it is important because first of all patients of psp cannot undergo deep brain stimulation surgery which patients of parkinson's disease can easily undergo the reason being that the progression of disease is very rapid and hence the effect of the surgery may not last as very long however at jaslok hospital it is the only center probably in india or in the world offering advanced surgical treatment for very select patients of psp i am repeating it is only offered to very select patients of psp whose progression of psp is very slow and they have frequent freezing as a major problem freezing means when you are walking your feet get stuck so you can't lift the leg and you you do it like that and then suddenly you then lift and move forward so this is called freezing and if the patient of psp has predominant freezing as a major problem he is still independent in walking and maintaining balance then we can evaluate them for deep brain stimulation surgery but by and large psp has to be managed medically and with other therapies this is an interactive channel this is a channel for you between you and me so i would like you to put down all your comments or questions that occur to you the questions that you want me as an expert to address or answer to be put down in comment section so that in the next segment of the video we can collect all that and share adequate and relevant information pertaining to that